Winterfest 2020 is here, finally. <laughs> I think it came out like three days ago. So I'm going to be checking it out today as well as give you guys all the information you need about the event based on past experiences with the event because it's happened for like over three years now. Um, seeing if anything new has happened. And uh, yeah, let's get right to that video. Now before I get started with the video, I need to ask you guys something. So um, it's about streaming. Again, streaming. It's been something that's on my mind for like uh, a long time now, clearly. I I've, I've did two test streams in the past. First one was a return stream and I was playing the game Osu and then after that I did Prodigy. But then since then I have not streamed at all and I will be trying to test another stream sometime soon. So just tell me um, if I should do that because I, I really hesitate with that um, because sometimes streams it can get a little scuffed and it can get a little you know issues can happen because streams it's just it's live it's hard to fix things. Um, but tell me if you guys want to see another stream and what game you guys want to see. Uh, I have added a couple new features to the streams, including a chat box and no, and like pop-up alerts and stuff, you know, all that, all that regular stuff. Um, but tell me what you guys want to see in the comments below and I'll get right to the video. Alright, so Pumpkin Fest, not Pumpkin Fest, Winter Fest 2020. It's here, okay. So uh, you all know what happened in Pumpkin Fest 2020. Um, it, it was kind of it made me a little sad, but again, I didn't really care. Um, they brought back an old arena gear, which which was supposedly exclusive to the season, but I guess not. Um, let's see if they did the same thing in Winterfest. I'm not sure if they did. I will be checking it out right here. Um, so Howard Cornelius, <laughs> ice to meet you, young wizard. What a fantastically chilly day it is. Um, Hans and I have brought a lot of cool items with us. We're super excited to be bringing Winterfest cheer to Lamplight Town. All right, I am too. Now let's see what you gave us. So, uh, I have never seen this pet before. Maybe I have, but they probably changed the artwork. So, I guess I don't anymore. Uh, uh, I don't. I don't recommend buying this at all. Honestly, uh, epics are better. <laughs> Even though epics are kind of like not supported anymore. Okay. Regardless, don't buy pets, buy gear. <laughs> that's, 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 what, that's what I recommend. They're selling pumpkins and, not pumpkins, uh, confetti and fireworks. I keep thinking about Pumpkin Fest, I don't know why. Uh, and here are all the hats, so let's see. Well, they have this thing that's new, I've never seen this before. I don't really like it, and like, don't like how it looks, but it's an uncommon, you can't ask for too much. Um, this thing, again, don't really like how it looks, it's a little too simple. Um, and the rest we all know the Yeti the Yeti the Yeti costumes are really really cool um, I remember wearing those they're really cool um, I would recommend people buying that save up for the good items save up for whatever you like don't listen to me I'm giving you my own personal opinion, but just buy whatever you like, okay? Um, let's see here uh, Is this new? Don't really like how this looks either. Uh, it, it just looks weird. Okay. It looks kind of yeah, I don't know the right word like a little like a little bit bulky. I don't know and then like not arranged well This one looks uh, much better than this Not surprised. I mean that's okay. That's all the outfits they have. Let's see the wands now There's this member one member exclusive one. This one actually looks pretty decent I, I actually kind of dig this one, but it's membership. I don't have membership anymore This one also looks pretty decent um, and not gonna lie, this one also looks decent and is not non-membership. The bell looks absolutely trash. Um, there's no color spark whatsoever, which I don't like. Um, and in the buddies, hmm. Actually, I've never seen these two buddies before, but I have epics again, which are 10 times better than any of the buddies you'll ever get during festive seasons. Winterfest shop. Alright, let's see this. We have a... Are these furniture? These are furniture. Now, I really don't dig house items. I think houses are a very cool idea to the game. But I really don't think it benefits you at all. And I think it's kind of a waste of your currency or your, your, your snowflakes. But that's just my own opinion. Some people really love doing their houses. You can show them off to people. But again, it doesn't really help you get better at the game. So <laughs> uh, I, I'm going to ignore most of these. The Christmas tree, I think... I think if it's your thing, you should get these and, you know, decorate your house for that season. But again, not that useful. Now, 
Winterfest, it's the same thing, right? Any festival, actually, it's the same thing. Basically, there is an item. In this case, it would be the snowflake, right? In Pumpkin Fest, it was a lantern that was not lit. This time, it's a snowflake. What you do is you, you go around Lamplight Town. Remember, it will only be in Lamplight Town. All right, so I'm going to open the map right here, right? Just, there's a crap ton of places. But no, only Lamplight Town. You go only go here. You circle around the entire area, and you'll find a snowflake, in this case, a snowflake, with a monster protecting it. Defeat the monster and you get 10. It's a daily challenge, so you gotta do your daily challenges, please. Um, so I'm actually going to do that right now and show you guys. We're just going to keep searching. It, it pretty, it's pretty friendly. It'll tell you where um, the snowflake is with like an exclamation mark pointing at it. So let's check over here. This is where survey was, right? Which is, you can do surveys. Oh, and there it is. So I was wrong. It is not a snowflake. It's a, it's a snowman. Or snow woman, whatever you want to, whatever you want to call it. Basically, what I know is you battle a monster and you get snowflakes. Um, so that's what we're going to do right now, and let's get right to this battle. Now, which which monster are we facing off against today? All right, so this is mm, I, I've never seen this monster before. They've added probably added new monsters. Don't get me wrong. Can we use epic attacks? We can. Okay, that's good. That's good. So we got that question wrong, so we're going to take a little bit of a hit here, but that's that's okay. 3,000 damage, that's actually quite a bit, but hmm, we will survive, we will survive. And we kind of wasted our epic attack. It's okay, though. Alright, this is going to be our first attack with the Supernova. It is not... I don't. I made a mistake, guys. Don't use Supernova if it's a singular enemy. Use it if it's for group damage. I just did it because I really don't find... <laughs> I, I really don't find any group enemies here. And, and we have two either way, so. Um, and I was just being dumb. Next question. This should finish him off. Please. Oh, no. He has 40, 400 health. And we're going to take another hit. That's okay, though. That's okay, though. I'm glad they removed uh, the crystal thingies I heal you. Because that was a pain to do a math question just to heal yourself. You get automatic healing now, which is much, much better. All right. Final attack. And he is gone. All right. Goodbye. I love the environment, by the way. It's it's it's, it's very nice considering it's Prodigy. Can I've this is Prodigy standards, okay? I'm not comparing this to some 3D like super graphic heavy game, okay? And also because this this game it's 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 artwork style has been very controversial. So it, it, let's just not talk about it. I I personally think the environment is really well done. But we got 10 snowflakes, I believe, right there. Um, I think we can check our currency somewhere over here. We have 32 snowflakes now. Yes, yeah, we got 10. Um, and what we can do is... I showed you this guy's already, but you go back. I'm going to play town. Right over here. Go to this guy. And you can buy whatever the heck you want. Um, I, I really don't want to buy anything in this shop, but there are... Or I either own them, but there. if you guys are new to the game or haven't really buy anything from Winterfest yet, I recommend you guys buy something, okay? It's, 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 it's mostly exclusive, I think. Um, and as for the season, come on, like, I think it's always, it's always nice to buy some seasonal gear, right? Um, uh, I already own most of this stuff and not interested in anything else. So, that is going to be it for me. Uh, I don't need to buy anything. We're going to go spin the wheel and... Let's see what we get. Always spin the wheel. Give me some foods. Everything else is not good. All right, let's see what we get. It's taking a long, long, long time to spin. They, they give you a piano for some reason. I, don't, I forgot what the piano was for. And what is that? I, I have no idea what these are for, by the way. Hot hots. Hmm. Yes, perfect for the cold season. No, I don't want to spin again because you're just going to ask me for membership. Um, what do th what do these hot hots do? All right, it says adventure in bonfire spire to earn these lava chips. Then spend them at the hot hot threads shop. Hot hot threads shop. Well, I, I'm pretty sure I don't need to buy anything over there. So that is going to be it for today's video, guys. I know it's a little bit shorter. It is not a playthrough video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.